My name's Jane Turner, I'm Senior Gardener at Clumber Park at Worksop. Day to day I look after the glass house and uh, the kitchen garden. There's four acres of kitchen garden, the glass house is 450 foot long and we produce um, fruit and vegetables for the use in the restaurant uh, and also as obviously as a visitor attraction. We're open for, to the public seven days a week um, from March through to the end of October. Uh, when I was at school, I, um, I actually wanted initially to be a ship stewardess, <laughs> something I never did because um, you had to be 23, I discovered, to do that. And when you're only about 16, 23 seems like really old. And it was pretty common to um, do things when I was at school, like be a hairdresser or be a nurse or something like that. And I didn't really want to do anything conventional, so I joined the police force. My mother was a nurse, so I think she was quite keen that I should be a nurse, but uh, I really didn't want to do that. And uh, by the time I think we had careers advice at school, I'd already decided that I wanted to join the police force, and they seemed to be very keen on trying to talk me out of it. I joined the cadets first of all as soon as I'd left school but when I was old enough to join the regular force um, I, I was posted back to my own town in Retford um, and I think that was quite a good move really um, because I know a lot of uh, police women in those days who were perhaps posted to bigger cities would just deal with shoplifters and things like that all day long whereas I managed to get quite a um, a lot of variety really so whatever came up and it might be just normal traffic offences or people missing from home, sudden deaths or so it was quite varied really. I did that for about four years and then got married to a policeman and uh, left shortly afterwards and um, eventually as the children grew up I started working in a building society part-time at first and I ended up there for 16 years and finished up as a mortgage underwriter. Well the turning point was definitely when I was ill. I had cancer 11 years ago and um, I, decide, I think I decided there and then that I would have to change my lifestyle. It was some time before I actually did that because obviously there was uh, quite a long period of uh, treatment uh, to undergo. So uh, I then started looking at different options but always came back to gardening because that was the thing that I enjoyed most. The love of gardening came from my granddad. He was a very keen gardener, had a large garden and I used to go and stay with him every school holiday and um, always used to help him in the garden. I think it, it, it developed from there so then obviously when I got my own garden then um, that became really my chief hobby, I think. I think in five years' time I probably see myself still being here, still doing this. I would hope so, anyway. Um, we've got lots of exciting projects underway at the moment and it would be very nice just to see how they progress. Obviously every garden takes time to, uh, to mature and um, we're, we're planting up some new borders this winter. So it would be very, very nice to just see how they progress in the future.